Welcome to the Wisdom Mastermind. Today we'll be solving a problem from two perspectives, a Zen monk and a Stoic philosopher. And today the question is, why do I feel unappreciated for my efforts, even when I'm trying to do good? This quote, Dogs and philosophers do the greatest good and get the fewest rewards reflects the common feeling of not being recognized for our contributions. It essentially translates to those who work hard and strive for the betterment of others often face a lack of gratitude or acknowledgement. This makes me wonder, friend, do you find yourself sacrificing your time and energy for others, but feeling unseen or unvalued? Tell me, what do you think of this problem? and how each of you would approach this question. The feeling of unappreciation can be a heavy burden, friend. Yet remember the teachings of Marcus Aurelius who urged us to focus on what we can control. We cannot control the actions or perceptions of others. Instead, we must seek fulfillment in the act itself, not in the external reward. As Seneca said, true happiness comes from within not from external factors. Focus on your actions, your intentions, and your internal peace. By striving for excellence in your deeds, you create your own reward. Release the need for recognition and allow the joy of giving to be its own reward. Ah, friend, the path of true service is not paved with expectations. As the Buddha taught, attachment to outcomes leads to suffering. When we act with selfless compassion, we release the ego's need for validation, the quiet satisfaction of offering kindness like a gentle breeze is its own reward. The universe moves in mysterious ways. What seems unappreciated today may bloom in unexpected ways tomorrow. Release your attachment to the outcome and embrace the act of giving as a beautiful dance of the heart. The true reward is found in the peace of letting go. Like, share, and subscribe for more daily wisdom. Thank you. Stoistica.